Welcome everyone to the Everything Show. I am your host, Matrix Lord Two One Two, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? Hello, all. What's up, Ben? Hello. What's up, Sally? What's up? All right. So, what do we got, Ben? Uh, you can do your stuff like, first if you want. No, yeah, man. Looks like some artist is claiming that solo the solo posters plagiarized his work. Oh boy. I'm trying to trying to find which one. So let's see if we can uh, get the French artist Hackam Bahoas claims that Disney copied the artwork that he made for Sony Music France for albums such as The Legacy of Funk and The Legacy of Jazz for solo Star Wars story clusters. And they do look very Look similar. at that. Look no at way. that. Yeah, okay. I was wondering what that was about. Yeah. Yeah. House of Mouse, you are sued. Oh. Ha. Ah. Geez, they didn't even try to make it look different. No, no. No, no not at all. Fingers. Not at all. Damn, Maybe. they just ripped him off, didn't they? Yeah. Looks yeah. like it to me. All right, House of Mouse, time to pay up. Yeah. Time to pay up a lot of money for that. Yeah. Wow, what an idiot. Yeah. Yeah. Do, I mean, if you're going to plagiarize someone, don't make it look like exactly the same thing. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Come on. Common Come sense, on. people. <sighs> Come on. I, I, I realize nuts. you've gotten real big, but it's gotten to the if it if this hurts you, dude. This is gonna really it's gonna be who's big. doing these stupid decisions? Yeah, that's dumb. I mean, you're a major motion picture, major thing. Now you could have you have to like remove all that stuff. What's up, Susie? That is Hi. absurd. Absurd. As a mm. mass being sued due their uh, due to their solo posters. Well, Avengers has a ton of May, whatever posters they have to get rid of now. They bumped the release date up from April. Wow. Yeah, that's true. Just trashed all those, right? Or keep I mean, these collector's they... items. Yeah. All right, so what other story you got besides that one? Mark Hamill still doesn't think Luke is dead in The Last Jedi. Neither do I. Neither do I. I don't want him to be dead, so uh, whatever did you, you want. Did you see his yeah. ring? I saw what? it. What ring? Engage the ring her? on that kit. That Wedding was his ring. I don't know about ring, but and he, it was a ring with the an insignia on it. Oh, I don't know. No. I don't yeah, know. John and I looked at each other and went, "Oh, he's hmm. incarnated." Hmm. Listen, I don't think they should kill Luke off either. I think that's just, you know, maybe, maybe they'll just, say, you know what? Maybe they'll say he wasn't even there either. He just island. exhausted himself using the Force hologram. I don't know. That's kind of weird. But we, we, we want him to be alive, but he's not going to be yeah. alive. He's going to be a ghost. and It shouldn't have happened, and a lot of people don't agree with it, but whatever. I don't All think right. he's going to be a ghost. I think he's going to be in that kid. He's going to be what? And the kid from the end of the movie. Who, the uh, he's gonna, the he's the gonna movie. possess the kid like friggin' paranormal no, activity. No, he's gonna be a reincarnation. He's not gonna possess oh, the we kid. ain't doing no reincarnation nonsense. They're not gonna do that. No. No, no, no. We he's not that. dead. I'm telling you, he's not dead. Oh. See, now you get me hungry you're eating cookies now. See that? Or chips or whatever you're eating? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? No, don't show that on the air. Okay. All right. All right. What else do you have, Ben? Okay. See the cookie. Um, what do you got, Ben? Cinnamon cookie. There was an article I read that said that um, Simon Kinberg, the dude who did all the X Men stuff, is is writing a script for a Star Wars movie that's not tied to the Game of Thrones directed ones or the Rian Johnson trilogy. That they're not tied, or they are tied? It's, let me get the find the article. I personally don't want Kinberg anywhere near Star Wars. He's, he's a hack. God. He's basically he's the Fox guy that basically uh yeah, the line of parts that he's doing is currently writing a script for a Star Wars movie. This is a, this is an addition to the trilogy and the works from Rand Johnson as well as the series of films from the Game of Thrones. Okay. All oh, right. He's the guy directing X Men Dark Phoenix who's never actually directed a movie before that. Oh. Uh, he's the reason uh, why Fantastic Four has never had a good movie. Oh God. Really? Oh, that's, that's what's to believe. No. Oh, my God. So start praying now, folks. Jeez. All right. What else? Um, 
it, it pays to pre-order from Best Buy because you sometimes get movies before the street date. Oh, you got it already? Jesus. Three days Jesus. early. Jesus. Wow, mm. go, go you, man. Still a good I movie. haven't seen that yet either. It's quite good. Wow. So when did you order it? I've had it pre-ordered since January. And oh, okay. The release date's Tuesday, so they ship it to kind of get kind of there by the release date. So if I ordered it tonight, would I get it Monday? I don't know. Uh, there's various versions you can get the... Steelbook, which is that one, the regular release, or the um, right. That looks pretty good, though. That looks pretty nice, actually. Let me see it again. Let's check it out. Got Thor on the front. Okay. Then on the back, it shows his gladiator helmet. Oh, oh nice. neat! And then, nice. if the discs weren't in the way, you got Thor jumping at Hulk. Wow! Oh, cool. Interesting. And now, how much does that run you? Normal price was would be about thirty six, but I used a twenty five dollar gift card to knock it down, so I only really paid nine dollars and fifteen cents for it. Nice. Ooh. Nice. Sweet. I watched it just now. I love that movie. Yeah. Can we get Korg his own MCU movie? Right. Blue I'm Korg. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right. What else? Anything else? Um, What's this turtles thing now? I mean, we talked about yeah, this before. Yeah. You're a big, you're a big turtles guy. Chris was talking to me about it. He said that people are flipping out about the design. They don't like it. Are some hardcore fans think it looks too radical? Kid friendly. They want more mature, like the old comics. Okay. Where they weren't so, happy. So a lot of people are pissed. Well, I think it's a kind of a downgrade from the cartoon that just ended, which had a lot of darker themes to it, which. They're, they're aiming for more for kids in this cartoon as opposed yeah, to... Yeah, well, like the that. comic book initially wasn't printed for kids. It was black and white, and they all Kill had people. the same colored uh, masks. Yeah, it's just... I'm going to give it a shot. If I don't like it, I'll say bye-bye. Didn't they do a Is preview of it cartoon? tonight or not? Huh? No, it's a new animated show. Yeah. Um, Did they preview it tonight or no? Uh, no, it's not, not going to be out till um, September. Oh, why did they preview like something tonight? Chris was telling me. I haven't seen anything. Okay. All right. Anything else? Or we're done. Oh wow. Slow news day, huh? Yeah. Pretty uh, much. Nothing. Mark Hamill says regarding him getting your own guardians. He says he doesn't know if anything will come of it, but he's thinking it's so funny how these things happen. Mm. Put Hamill in Guardians Three. He'd be perfect for that. Kind he of has movie. to be in Guardians Three, though. He would fit so much. Like he could, they could do something with him really good. I'm pretty they, sure. Well, depending what age they want, that Adam Warlock have Mark Hamill be Adam Warlock. That's yeah. what somebody even said on another cast. Yeah. I, oh, I gotta say something else too. I, the other day we were talking about some of the relaunches and different things from Marvel. Yeah. And the thing they came up with Doctor Strange, which they didn't really do before, they feel is they're gonna bring Doctor Strange to space. And have him have different spells. Yeah, I don't know. And have different Those spells, are, uh, magic in space. I mean, it's a fish out of water. I don't know what the hell like that's about. It's like they're in the Ghost Rider that's going to be in space. I mean, yeah, that's supposed to be Frank Castle. Isn't that which uh, is Lobo? Pun Punisher is the... I don't know, man. I don't, I'm not for that. Marvel that's needs stupid. to just pick something and stick with it. Yeah. Stop yeah. rebooting it everything every five minutes. I'm sorry, but nobody thinks of Doctor Strange in space. No. Nope. Nor he does anybody be. really want to see that anyway, so... He should be in the Sanctum Centaurum. Yeah, I mean, that's just yeah. ridiculous. With Wong. Yeah. They, oh, speaking of that, all those um, Infinity War Lego sets are available now. Oh, yeah? We were looking at... Oh, that I totally Sanctum forgot Sanctum. about that, dude. If that Sanctum Centaurum set goes down below 100, I'm picking that bad boy up. It's over 1,000 pieces. <laughs> Damn. Damn is right. My beard will be down to here once I'm done. Ah! <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right. Um, there is a Doctor Who Lego set. Did you see it? Yep, it's in my shelf. Yeah, yeah. I want to get one for my nephew. I'm this totally is another Doctor Who Lego set. It's nice to have one already. Hmm. I'm going to turn him on to Doctor Who. Are you? Yeah, before he's old enough to watch it. Yep. 
Okay. Gonna have That's another okay. sci-fi fan in my family. I'm not gonna be the only one. Uh-huh. Uh, also, it my father like- said, I can't understand it. You used to watch horror flicks. I said, yeah, Dr. Fives. <laughs> no. hmm. Give me a yeah. good horror flick, something with a good story. You know, then right. I'll be on, you know. I like good stories. Yeah. Uh, what else? You have something else, Ben? You were saying something? Yeah, the uh, looks like the Walgreens exclusive Reed Richards is uh, the one that comes with interchangeable stretchy arms that you can bend. Oh, really? Like Marvel Legends, yeah. They Walgreens has been getting the Fantastic Four figures. They had an exclusive Sue Storm, I remember. So, but the new Reed Richards comes with arms with those bendy wires in it that look like he's outstretched his arms. Oh, nice! Like a stretch Armstrong? No, no, just a, like the old Bendham figures. Those, can, those, those little, those old fashioned like uh, rubbery dudes. Oh, like Gumby and Pokey. Yeah. Yeah. Similar. Wow. Okay. So is this last? Uh, so has the last uh, Fantastic Four movie was that made in the special Sue Richards version of being invisible? Or burning a dumpster. Fire. You know, you know what's weird about that whole thing with the um, with Fox is that they're going to pump out tons of movies before yeah. the deal goes through. They're going to do a, a Doctor Doom movie. They're going to do um, Silver Surfer movie. Yep. They're going to do X Men movies up the friggin' X. No, no it's more like Fox ridiculous. X-Men. Please. There's going to be tons of X Men movies, Deadpool, X Force, New Mutants. They added a character, New Mutants. They're going crazy. Because they know a, a new trailer for uh, New Mutants. I watched it. It was just the. I don't they're know making they, it more horror now, and they're adding a okay. character to it. So that's. I watched it. Like they may have asked, added make a, maybe a couple more minutes to it, but it's just the same trailer as the last one. But I don't see how you could add a character if the movie's done. Like the movie is supposed to be released like now, and 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 how do you how do you to add a character? That means you have to change the entire script. So maybe it's not as done as we think it is. Maybe it's really screwed up because how could you just add a character to a movie that's finished, right? Ben, I mean that's so, stupid. Yeah, yeah. 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 You can't just you know, add it. No, I'm talking just... the whole entire movie. They added a character. Can't just add somebody to it, the whole script. Huh. You're supposed to do that before you release a movie. Uh-huh. Well, no, they didn't. They delayed the movie, but now we know why. Possibly, mm. maybe something was wrong with it. But I mean, they said they, they had wanted to go more back horror. and rewrite. They said that they wanted to make it more horror than than anything else. But They're that would be off of a it, a run of the comics that was kind of hard based. Like yeah, but the movie's done now. You now down. you go back. You're shooting stuff. In it, but now when you add a character, you can't just add stuff like that. So in other words, to it me, was probably it was probably footage they already had. No, they okay. added someone new, which just doesn't make any sense. So I don't know about New Mutants people. I I'm a little worried there. If I were you. You don't just add things. That's like saying, oh, um, we finished Justice League, but we're going to add Green Lantern now to the entire movie. You can't do that. So tell me how you could do that, because you can't do it to a movie that's finished. I mean, yes, if you wanted to make it scary, you could add the scenes, you could do stuff, whatever, but to change an entire movie like that to add somebody? No. I don't think so. All right, we're going to get out of here. Thank you, guys. Take care. Bye for now. Bye.